What is going on guys, Johnny or Magic Everyday back with a brand new video and today I'm going to be teaching you guys a super cool magic trick from the show America's Got Talent. So I don't want to waste any of your time, I'm going to show you guys what it looks like first and then afterwards I'm going to teach you guys how it was done. Alright, so this is what the trick looks like. So we have a deck of cards here, all the cards are different, and then we have a Rubik's Cube. Now the Rubik's Cube will sit here the entire time, I will not go anywhere near it until later on in the trick. So if I had somebody here, I would go through the cards and have them say the word stop. So let's just say, for instance, that they stop me right here at the Nine of Spades. Now I would take the Nine of Spades and just rip a piece right off of the corner of it, just like that. Now watch the piece. If I squeeze and just rub like that, I can make the piece completely disappear. Now you're probably wondering, where did the piece go? Believe it or not, from before we even started, I'll show you both of my hands are empty, inside of this cube. No, not inside the cube there, but actually inside of one of the pieces here is a card. Check this out. If I pull this piece off, you'll see there is a card inside of the cube piece. And check this out. If I open it up, you will see that this is indeed the nine of spades. And that matches up absolutely perfectly, just like that. So now we're going to get into the tutorial. All right, so I know you guys are probably super excited to want to learn how I did this trick. So this is how it is done. For this, all you need is a normal deck of cards and a Rubik's Cube like I have here. Uh, this is a speed cube that actually allows you to pull the pieces apart. I'm not sure if you could do this on a regular Rubik's Cube, so you might have to do it a little bit differently. You can obviously put the card in the middle of the cube like that, but I like to put it into one of the pieces. So this is a speed cube where you can remove that. So you're going to take any card you want at all and just rip off the corner just like I did here so this is the nine of spades I ripped off the corner and now what you're going to do is just fold this up so that you can fit it inside the cube now there's so many different ways you can perform this trick you can put this piece in an apple I mean there's like a hundred different things that you could do with this trick but here I'm gonna stick it inside of this corner piece of the Rubik's Cube and then we're gonna somehow some way put this piece back together two hours later Okay, so we finally got the piece back together. That was way more difficult than it needed to be. So now we're just going to put the cube back together. So there's the one piece. Let's get this other corner piece here. Put that in. Eventually. There we go. And then finally the middle piece here. And now our cube is completely back together. So now you just got to remember which piece it's in. It's obviously in the yellow, green, and orange piece right here. Now you're all set to perform the trick. You have your card with half of a piece ripped off. You're going to put that into the middle of the pack uh, with this ripped piece facing towards you. Now you're just going to put your pinky right above this card, put the pack on top, and then you're just going to force the card. So you're going to have them say stop. Wherever they say stop, you just lift up the pack right to where the ripped card is. So they say stop. We rip it up, but you don't want to show the ripped card. So you're going to hold the cards so that they see the bottom card here. And then you're kind of just going to pull this off and cover it up. So obviously I'm just covering up the ripped piece there. So they say stop, pull the piece off, cover it, and then you're just going to pretend to rip it. Boom. You pretend to rip it, obviously there's nothing in your hand, so you can easily make that disappear. And that is basically the trick. And then the card is in the Rubik's Cube. Just gotta take it apart and show it to them. So I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. If you did, make sure to subscribe, obviously, because I have plenty more magic tutorials coming in the near future. And thank you guys so much for watching. This is Johnny, your magic every day. Peace out.